and hopefully nail his ass. Oh, there we go. We have success. He's gone. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Everybody, much adventure here today. I'm playing. This is Star Trek The Next Generation for the NES, or for the, yeah, for the NES. Let's do this. Star Trek for the NES. Look, they start out with a, uh, they start out with the freaking credits, man. That's how you know. They, they, they've prided themselves into this by putting their names the very first thing you see. And there's Jean-Luc. There's Jean-Luc. Yeah, they totally did. They totally did, Raddy. Let's just start the game. Let's just get right into it. This is going to be confusing. I can just tell. The Federation Bajor colony is under siege. Oh, no. Proceed to quickly prevent an enemy invasion of the colony. Okay, what's going to... What is this even going to be? Oh, I can choose who I want to be. I was always a data guy myself. I was definitely a data guy. Nice, Sally, man. And free content. Me, people, support gaming. I like it, dude. That's awesome. Win-win. It is a win-win. Okay, we're gonna be data. I have nothing to report, data. What am I doing? What's going on? I gotta remember, this is Nintendo. Okay, Bajor. Let's go to Bajor. It's not letting me. Oh yeah, here we go. Warps, warp 9, data, to Bajor. We're going to Bajor, guys. We gotta protect the colony, apparently. That's eight streams on two monitors. Let's go, Salamander. You're the you're the king. The king. Oh shit! What am I doing? I don't want to go forward anymore, do I? You're the king of support. Yeah, these are great sounds. Okay, we don't need this. I think we I think what we need to do, guys, is actually hit up. Hey, how do we get out of here? We go this way. This is not doing this is doing nothing. Oh wait, here we go. Who's the... Okay, I think we gotta talk to Chief O'Brien and beam some dudes down here. Right? The ship must be in orbit. Okay, so we gotta orbit the ship. Well, Data, can you orbit the ship for us or what, dude? Nothing to be transported. The ship must be in orbit. Okay, well... Oh my god, I can't... You can't back out of here. Oh yeah, oh you select is back out, okay. The Federation Bajor Colony is under siege. Yeah, well, we're here, buddy. Okay, so he just gives them... Riker just gives the updates. Yeah, O'Brien was old, and he still is old, dude. That's what's crazy about... It. Oh, I see. We gotta go see Data. He's flashing. Data is flashing. Sensors indicate the presence of other ships in the sector. Oh, God, Data. What do we do? Status online. I don't think we care, Data, to be honest. Yeah, yeah, I forget his name. He's he's in um he's in a couple of movies as like an Irish dude. Well who cares, Data? We're still going. We don't care about ships. Let's orbit the dang planet. What does Jordy do? What's he saying? Boosted systems. Yeah, we don't need to boost. We don't need to repair. So he's the repair guy, Data's the flying guy. Worf is the, the fighting guy. O'Brien well, is our, uh... Let's see what's going on here. We're in... How do we orbit this shit, dude? Like, we're already in... I thought we were already here. Thought we were already in... The place. Yeah, Reddy, I believe that this was, um... I believe this was in, like, 1993, I think. What's Data saying? Sensors indicate the presence of other ships. Okay. 
What do you want me to do with that news data? Sensors. Oh, I see. We gotta do a little game here. Oh shit, we got Romulans. We got Romulans. What is that? Romulan ship, no damage. Oh, is he fighting me? Planet. There's a planet. Bajor. That's weird. I don't know what to do with this newfound knowledge that I have of this Romulan ship. Are we just fly? This is so. This you. This must be a manual reading game where you have to read the dang manual. You know what I mean? Oh, is he powering down? Oh shit, he's powering down. Probably should power up Worf. You should probably power it up. These shields. Yep. Yeah, let's do it. Hell yeah. Now can we fight them, Worf? Let's arm the phasers. Yep, yeah, there we go. Phasers armed, shields armed. We're ready for action now. They want to screw with us? We'll see. We'll see. Orbit. Okay, here we go. We must be closer to the planet. Oh, okay, here we go then. Let's do this. And then I think... I, like, turn it. How do we turn this ship? It's not really like. Oh, I'm slowly turning. Oh. Slowly turning. Very slowly. Get me closer! God's sakes. One thing I hated about Nintendo games of this era was what the very confusing Nintendo games. I'm getting closer. They always required a manual to read. Here we go. You know what I mean? They always needed a manual. Oh, oh, those you didn't understand what the hell you're doing. That's kind of like this game. Okay, let's do it. Must be closer. I thought I was right there, guys. Data. Oh, come on. He's going to tell me I'm not close enough. I'm on the planet. Oh, shit. He's shooting me. Yo, Worf. Okay, okay, we're all, we're literally, literally on the planet, right? There's no way Data is going to tell me that we can't orbit. Oh my god. Unbelievable. I feel like I saw that coming. Yeah, I don't know, Randy. Does it stack up? The branding of the game is good. The faces are good, but is this even a game worth playing? I think this is like a game that they're like, you know... Let's give literally Star Trek nerds, not even nerds, but like fans, you know, let's give true Star Trek fans um, an, an authentic experience. And by doing that for the Nintendo, it's not an intuitive game. I mean, I don't know what's going on. I'm Worf, I'm Data. W what are we doing here? We're beaming. We can't beam guys because we're not in orbit. How do I get in orbit? I'm with Data. I'm literally on the thing. We're already on Bajor. There's, it's got to be with data. The the something has got to be here, right? If I press start. Nothing. Okay, it goes back to. Oh wait a minute! I think I control. Hang on. Wait a minute. I think I can control where I'm going in this ship. With, and, and like shooting. Hang on. I think I'm controlling. It does look like a big game. Oh, look at this. Oh, see, they're here. Hang on, hang on. I shouldn't be so uh, quick to talk here. Oh, shit. Yeah, there we go. Look, we just set a course, guys. We're setting a course to Bajorn, or whatever the hell it's called. And there we go. There it is. Whoa, there it is. Now let's see if we can, uh, let's see if we can orbit this shit now. Oh, we can. Oh, do I have to do, is this a mini game? Oh, Jesus. Oh, I got that one. Oh, got that one, I think. 
Oh my god, what am I doing? Whoa. I'm trying to keep it in here. Where's the next one? No, I lost it. Shit. Oh my... Oh, I'm orbiting. Hell yes. Okay, guys. You're liking this game, eh, Ready? Yeah. For back in the day? Yeah, for sure. This would... For a Star Trek fan with, like, proper manuals and stuff? Okay, I think we gotta beam some dudes down now. Let's go. I'm into it now. Let's go. I was almost ready to give up there, but now I'm, f I'm fully in. Beam down, yep. Oh, the shields must be lowered. Okay. Makes sense. It's true. You have to do that in the Star Trek world. You gotta lower the shields. Raise... Roll the shields, wolf. Otherwise, you just transport and get fried or something. I don't know how that works. Okay. Let's concentrate. O'Brien. Yes. Beam up? No, beam down, dude. Oh, there's nothing to be transported. Okay, so I think we have to, like... Is it Riker that we gotta talk to? Let's talk to Riker. Riker, you useless sack of son of a gun. Who do we gotta talk to, then? Jordy? No, there's no way. He's just engineering. Worf, maybe, to go down? No, look, he's, he's like, Worf's into two things. It's guns and shields. He likes guns and shields. There's gotta be a, a way that I have to, like, select a mission. Somehow. Nothing here to be transported. What do you guys think is the answer here? What is the solution here? Not wharfs, not data. Maybe it is data. Get a sensor going. Maybe it is beta. Beta. Yeah, right on belt. Later. Thanks for watching. See you for the big draft tomorrow. Okay, let's let's hone in on this Romulan ship. Get involved in that. Whoa, easy data. Easy big fella. There's the Romulan ship. Oh my god. Oh my god. What is he doing? He's just swooping in hundreds of times. Let's get him. Let's get his ass. Bonsoir. Okay, let's, uh... Let's figure out what we gotta do here. This must be painful for someone who's who knows this game. And is like, what are you doing? Like, all I'm thinking is, like, is it because this Romulan ship is here, I have to kill that, and then I can go on? The Bajorans or whatever? Let's just go green only. I still don't get what's happening. Uh-oh. This caution. I don't know why. I love these sounds, eh? They really do sound like ancient. So they're under siege, so I have to kill the, the thing then. That's it. That's simple as that. I have to kill these dudes. I have to kill these these Romulans. That's it. Let's load it up, Worf. We're going in, buddy. You love this, Ratty. I'm glad somebody's loving it. I'm glad somebody's loving it. Uh, hopefully somebody else, if you're watching this, you'll love it too. Okay, we're going in. I'm tired of losing. We're going in. What do I do here? I don't I don't get this. Is that what you think it is, Ready? The green squares only? Oh, you think it was... It was <laughs> I think, like, do I have to go? Uh... 
Like Romulan ship, and then it's like lock that in. How do I lock this shit in? You know what I mean? I don't think I can. Oh! Oh! And I have phasers! Oh man, I didn't know that! Now it's on. Now we're talking. Oh shit. Now the battle rages. Okay, we're gonna do this. I'm just gonna stay still. And we're gonna search for Buddy. There they are. Now the battle rages, my friends. Oh. Now we're getting them. Let's go. Jesus, this guy is shifty, man. Oh, we got a direct hit. We got a direct hit. Oh, I just got a direct hit. Oh man, shit is pick business has just picked up, boys. Business is picking up. Oh my god, he's killing people on the Federation ship. Oh my god, do I have to start moving again? Oh my god, I gotta start moving again. I can't fight like this. We gotta keep we gotta keep a little bit of speed and distance going. Oh uh, get there though. Oh man, I just rocked his world. Oh hell yes. Let's where'd he go? Where'd he go? Oh I got hit there. That was a direct hit. What a battle. Oh my god. Oh, I don't remember Star Trek toys in shreddies. What was, what did that look like? Oh man, I rocked his world for a minute there. What were the shreddies Star Trek toys? I gotta take this guy out, dude. What is it? Oh shit, he's right there too. He's hitting me a lot less, that's for sure. No, the little cheap Enterprises, I don't remember. I used to have tons of little Enterprise models and stuff as a kid. I had lots of Star Trek toys. I was a big Star Trek guy. Oh my god. Oh, how am I not hitting him? How? Oh, let me get there. Jesus. Okay, I'm going to plan B where I don't even move and I just track this guy down. And hopefully nail his ass. Oh, there we go. We have success. He's gone. Say goodbye. Hell yes. Well done, cadet. The colony's been saved and peace has been restored. There you go, guys. We just beat Star Trek. <laughs> I wish. Mission successfully completed. Rank Ensign. Password lore. Oh, damn. A freighter near planet Vulcan reports it's been under attack. Oh, here we go again. Here we go again. Oh, what flavor of haagen did you get? Oh, I gotta change my, uh, I should ch I should have changed my game um, thing. You just reminded me, Raddy. Two. Star Trek. What the hell game is this? I'm just gonna hit retro, forget that. Retro. <laughs> Two, vanilla Swiss Almond Oil, that's one of the best ones right there, by, by far. By far one of the best ones. Okay. Mission success. What do we have to do again? Vulcan, okay, we gotta go to Vulcan. We're going to Vulcan, boys. Buckle up. Mr. Data, take us away to Vulcan. 
Warp uh, 3. Mr. Data, Warp 3 to Vulcan. Aye, aye, sir. Sir, Vulcan appears to be under attack by a promulent vessel of unknown origin. Uh, okay, we're here. Uh oh. Who are these knobs? Are they gonna need a smackdown immediately? Sir, senses indicate the presence of other ships in this sector. Senses online, Mr. Data. Senses online. Ferengi and a freighter. Oh, we gotta talk to these Ferengis. You know what? I think we might. I think I might need a. Uh... Mr. For Mr. Mr. LaForge. We need to repair the ship. No. Are these guys gonna shoot me? Or can we talk? I think we gotta take these Ferengis out, guys. I don't like to do it, but I think we have to. We're getting there, too. Mr. Wolf! That phases to maximum. We're, mo we're making our way, guys. Now that I know how to play. It's all coming together. Oh shit. Damn, dude. Well, how about, how about, oh Jesus. Let's get that, let's get it, let's get it. Where's it going? I love the classic sound of like space. You know what I mean? In your ear. Like it's just like the Nintendo sound of space. Oh, we have, we have sighting of the Ferengi ship, I believe. Slow down, Mr. Data. Slow down. Mr. Data. Destroy ship immediately. Mr. Wolf. That phases to destruction. Okay, what's going on here? Whoa, Vulcan freighter has got it. Oh my god, what are we seeing here? The Vulcan freighter, I believe, would be, um... The green one, I think? Okay, thank you, Mr. Wolf. Mr. Wolf, phases is armed. Would you, though? I may have rented this. You wouldn't have even been a preteen, I don't think, right? I mean, this is so old. Actually, maybe. They're shooting me now. So it's on. These pricks think they got me. You guys don't know what you... You don't know what you're getting yourselves into. You don't know what you're getting yourselves into, Ferengis. Are they? Sh I think they're shooting at me too. Yes. Oh, they were shooting me, the bastards. Oh, am I lost? This is very confusing. Whoever programmed this game, it must have been a real nerd too. I swear to God. I'm trying to turn the ship around, it's so slow. There he is. There he is, I can't get him. I'm so slow. I'm so slow, get him. Oh, hell yeah. Get him. I can't turn fast enough. Mr. Data, turn the ship faster. God damn it. Mr. Data, turn the ship faster, Mr. Data. I'm getting some good phasers on him, but we're not getting the photon bombs on him. Damn it! Yes, 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 y
And this would be entertaining as hell. Oh, goodbye, Ferengis. Will Jean Luc give me a meeting, or did I just do something wrong? Yeah. Excellent. The freighter can now successfully reach its destination. Yeah, compute man, exactly. Not enough action. 100%. And I think I played... I must have rented this as a kid. There's no way I would not have rented this. And I kind of remember... I feel like I remember the bottom parts of this. Or I definitely had the Game Boy version, which I think was similar to this. Too much reading and too much, like, knowing... I agree, compute man. Mario is like... You, you, you're Mario and you go... This is like... You have to read, and then you have to be like, oh, I have to go to Vulcan, and then you'd be like, oh, I have to kill the Ferengi that's there. Oh, I have to do this. Like, it's, like, way more involved for a kid. More Ferengi? Jesus Christ, Ferengi. Do they ever stop? But when am I going to get to do something else? You know what I mean? I don't want to just blow up Ferengis all day. Let me, like, talk to them. So I think they're doing two kill missions, like, right off the bat to make you, like, entertain with this game. But at the end of the day, I mean, uh, you know, you're going to have to beam down to places. I wonder if you could ever do that. Like, show me what it looks like to beam down to a planet. Is there a game play if you beam down to a planet? Let's try it. Let's see. Let's see what's going on. Let's try one more thing, guys, then I'm probably out of here. But let's see how far we get. Oh, I don't want to do this. Whoops. You would have just made it up. But then, how do you make a game up and then... Yeah, that's true, though. I know what you're saying, Raddy. See, I feel like I would be like that with, uh... Like, if you're a kid playing, like, Grand Theft Auto and stuff, man, when we were that age, I would have made up the craziest stories in those kind of games. Like, an open-world game as a kid would have been... It would have been just insane. You could have played it for a hundred million zillion hours. Yeah, exactly. You, this is this is you, compute man. You go, what the hell is going on? You would have been me the first five minutes of this game. Um, let us. Where do we have to go? Altar five. Altair five. We're going, Mr. Data. To the course for Altair five. Thank you. Yes, yes, Captain. Here we go. Yeah, you would have done this, right? You guys would have done this as kids. This is fun. We're going warp speed, and then you get to somewhere. But honestly, you know you know it wouldn't last long. The excitement, the joy of this game, you know it wouldn't last long. You know you would eventually get so bored of this. Oh, damn. More Ferengis. Oh, Jesus Christ. What does LaForge need? Phaser system has sustained damage? Oh, my God. Oh shit, what do I have to do? What do I have to do? We gotta let all the ship pass through, boys. There we go. Like, did what I just do there have... <laughs> well, the impulse is dead now. I think I just do this. Is this it? I just turn these from nothing to on and then that's it? That's very simple. I think I just turn the X's into these and then the, the things pass through and then I win. It, this, this reminds me of, um, not Plinko. This reminds me of, uh, oh, that Pipe Dream game. I think it's called Pipe Dreams where you like have to switch pipes and stuff. Everything's damaged, guys. The whole goddamn ship's damaged. Wait, is S, T, and P something different? Huh. Like, am I not fixing the right stuff? Yeah, exactly, right. I don't think I'm doing this properly. Oh, I am. Because everything's fixed. So there we go. Hell yeah, I am doing it properly. Yeah, I remember that Pike Scream Saber. I used to like that. What's Data saying? Other ships. Yeah, no shit, Data. We figured that one out. Mr. Wolf. Phases. Oh shit, there's a guy right there. No. 
There's two goddamn Frankies this time. Oh, look at these unboosted phasers, boys. They're, they're pink now, for God's sakes. I think I got boosted phasers. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. I'm so slow. Okay, I'll go this way. So this is Star Trek, okay. Let me walk, let me walk on a damn planet. That's what I'm saying, you know what I mean? This is just, no, just literally just destroy Ferengis. Shit. Oh shit, Jordy wants me. Jordy, we have no time, Jordy. Oh, there goes one down. Is there two though? Oh, there's two. Shit, I'm still getting attacked. But by who? Oh, there he is, right there. Damn, we got a lot of guys in this. Oh, two direct hits with the photon grenades. Photon torpedoes, I mean. Holy shit. It's Frankie's getting... Oh, there's another one. Oh my god, this guy's getting destroyed. Hang on. Hang in there, Jordy. Yes. Come on, Captain. Lay it on me, Captain. Tell me I'm a good ensign. Yes! The interstellar trade routes are once again safe from the Ferengi. The goddamn Ferengi, man. Well, I'm a lieutenant already. Holy shit. How is the password the same thing, though? Stolen cargo is being hoarded on Risa by renegated Ferengi. Retrieve the cargo from the planet. Okay, here we go. Ferengi ships may be in the area. Long live the Romulans. Here we go. Good. Guys, this is the last one. This is the last one I'm doing. I want to see if I can go on the planet. I gotta see it. Can we do it? Can we go on the planet? Because if we can go on the planet, this would be great. Also, what do you guys think of the new layout for my uh, retro games here? I got my head bigger. I got the chat going. I think it's uh looks better. And it will be better. Okay, what is data on? There's more ships? Oh, for Christ's sakes. For Christ's sakes. We got two damn Ferengis. Jordy's gonna be pissed at me. You like it? Nice. Okay, good. Shields damaged. I don't get what, the, what I'm supposed to do, to be honest. I feel like S, S in the middle means shield, and then T on the left is, I don't know, and P on the right is phasers? Could I be right or could I be wrong? Literally no idea what that is. Okay, well, you know what, guys? I think that's it for me. I think that's it for me, and that's it for Star Trek tonight. Uh, what's my rating of Star Trek? You know what? You need a manual, which is fine, of the Nintendo games of old. Uh, if you had a manual, everything would make sense. And it's a cool game, so you know what? I would have liked to see a little bit more variety with... I mean, what did I do? Three missions already? I literally did three missions already, and they've all been the exact same thing. So, I mean, I would like to see a little bit more variety for me. With at least the first couple of missions. Like, let me go down. Let me, let me talk. You know, let me be the captain and talk different stuff and you know diplomacy let me go down and shoot guys on the planet i don't know you know just give me something give me something other than just this but maybe that's all the game is i have actually no idea but i don't i didn't mind it so it would be a good renter if you knew that you were renting it with the uh the manual otherwise i mean otherwise you'd be like me and you're just we're just we're just trying to sit here figure this out together so i mean it's a it's a decent yeah, three-day renter, exactly, Raddy. If you could get if you could get a uh, a rental of this with the manual. A lot of rentals I remember back in the day never had the manual, and that was a very especially like the Nintendo era. And it wasn't uh it wasn't the best. Anyways guys. Thanks for watching, as always, everybody. 
Thanks for watching as always.